Hello, my name is Samuel Myers. Growing up, I didn't really go to church as much as I wanted to or really understand the Word of God as much as I should have or wanted to. Um, I think the biggest turning point in my faith was probably in 2017 after my dad had a series of four heart attacks and then later was diagnosed with uh, cancer. And going from there, it was just a battle off and on for the last seven years, but I kind of faded away from my faith just because I couldn't understand why the Lord would put a family through that for, you know, such a long time. I continued to just keep leaning on Him, which is um, probably one of the reasons that I am here today. Um, and then just knowing that He has been able to be a, just a strong person that I could lean on through this whole thing has kind of been the reason that I have been able to find faith in Him. I've found growth in like my father's struggles with his health, just um, in my faith as far as seeing him be able to bounce back from the constant downs to come back up has just really, it's like a miracle honestly, just being able to see somebody at their lowest point be able to fight it off and come back to where they are now. We started going to church more and then probably the beginning of, towards the beginning of last year, uh, we decided to join a couples group and they have also been there just to help us lean into to our faith more and just to fall more into the Word of God. I think that's probably the biggest step forward that we have made is just putting our trust in God and leaning on Him regardless of how hard things get. So I'd like to thank my wife Abigail and my, my four-month-old daughter Isla. Um, for helping me with my faith journey and my church my couple's church group um, they all really impacted my faith just helping me fall deeper into the word of god hi my name is sam and i'm here today to declare jesus christ as my lord and savior sam thanks so much for sharing your story with us and uh, man i'm so encouraged to see you take this step in your faith, not just get baptized, but to put your faith in Jesus. And um, man, what you're doing to lead your family and the, the legacy that you are on the path of leaving um, is so good. And that's not just good for you, but it's, it's good for them too and good for us. We're really encouraged by your story. And um, because of your declaration of faith in Jesus as your Lord and Savior, it's my honor and privilege to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit.